So this article is from the old Walkabout magazine, and it's about Robert Endine, one of the pioneers of research on the reef and discoverer of the Cranothorn starfish plagues. And this is what he said. Before the 1960s, the Cranothorn starfish had been a rare animal. In 1960, it was still such a novelty that when a single specimen appeared on the reef outside Cairns, naturalists made special trips to observe it. Why then did it emerge from obscurity in 1963 to become a plague on the Great Barrier Reef? Well, it's a good question, and there are two possibilities. The first is that humans started to do something around the early 60s. The second thing is that, well, maybe nobody was looking before then.